What is up everyone? My name is Brianna. I'm a proud introvert. Welcome or welcome back to Introvert TV. So today's video is super exciting because we are going to be trying out a croc dupe from Walmart. So this is Walmart versus Crocs. I'm super excited because not everybody can afford Crocs. I mean, they are a little expensive, even though you can find them cheaper. Um, but I decided that we were gonna try some cheap Crocs. Well, I got one pair of Crocs from Walmart. We're gonna compare that one pair of Crocs to Crocs. And if there's any other websites that have Croc dupes, comment down below or DM me on Instagram to let me know. And that way I can film the video for you guys if you're interested in the quality of them. So I have everything pulled up here on my iPad. I like to say very nice and organized. So these videos are right to the point and I'm not just rambling. So if you're not already subscribed, make sure to go ahead and subscribe. Check out my links down below to my Instagram and Depop. And if you'd like to see the Walmart dupe, then just keep on watching. All right. So I went on Walmart and I found these. These are called the men's garden shoes, men's clog shoe, very comfy size eight to 13. So a good variety of sizes, but it is in men's sizes. So it says it was listed for $18.99, but I got them for $14.98. On these, the features for these Crocs say men's very comfortable clog slingback shoe, garden sandals, nurse shoe for beach, pool, and everyday wear men's sizes. Easy slip on clog, ultra lightweight, um, suitable for indoor and outdoor activities, beach, pool, and work, indoor house shoe, or even for shower. Man made material, EVA, and imported. So that is the um, features that was listed on the Walmart website. I will have the link to these and yeah, so that is what I got and I have them right here. I'll have the date that I ordered them and the date that I received them right up on the screen. And yeah, so I'm going to be comparing them to the, um, classic clog from Crocs, of course, and the classic clogs retail for $44.99. So the ones I got from Walmart, 14, oh my God, get it together, Brianna. $14.98 from Walmart, $44.99 from Crocs. So there is a big difference there. So if these are good, then we'll, we'll see if I recommend you guys to get them. So yeah, $44.99. Um, classic clog details, incredibly lightweight and fun to wear. Water friendly and buoyant, weighs only ounces. Ventilation ports add breathability and help shed water and debris. Easy to clean and quick to dry. Pivoting heel stri straps for more secure fit. Customizable with gibbet charms. Iconic crop comfort, lightweight, flexible, 360 comfort. And that's the features for the classic clog, which is like the like this one and this one on my tree. So yeah, so if you'd like to see me compare both of them and do an on feet, then just keep on watching. All right, so let's just get into this package. It already came with like a little tear. So oh, that makes it easier for me. All right, nine and I got them in a dark brown color. They come with this plastic wrapping, which is very loud. Okay, very cool, cool, cool. So it just comes with like the little, these little things there. And then, oh, oh, they smell like, oh my God, they smell like chemicals, but like, it smells like other sandals, like that chemical smell that like Walmart shoes have. That's what it smells like. It smells like paint and chemicals. Um, interesting, and this just says, Ah, uh, comfort, ah, uh, comfort. I don't know if you guys can see that, but that's what that says here. And this is what these look like. So they look like this, pretty cute. Um, and then this is what the bottoms look like. It says ladies 11, men's eight. So. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take that, oh, that off and I have a classic clog to compare these two, which you can immediately see the difference. I literally seen the difference as soon as I took them out. These holes are mega, these are like the size of a dime 
and these ones are really small compared to these ones so the sizing and then the shape is different so that these ones kind of go out like this and these ones are a little deformed compared to that so there is a big difference the inside pattern is completely different the inside sole very different and also this is completely deformed like completely going the wrong way it's oh my god let me put this sound so you guys can see oh my god is the other one like that oh it is kind of like that not as bad these were like really bad oh oh my freaking god let's see what these ones look like okay so these technically kind of do go out but not as much as this like that is insane so <laughs> but these are the strap difference so the strap is a little bit thicker and the bottoms look like this so this is of course the croc and these ones are more like heavy duty they go out they're a lot taller you see these ones are pretty much flat and these ones go out taller higher they go out higher um let's try putting a gibbet in these and see okay so i just have this random gibbet and it's just like a ambulance and we're gonna try putting this in there okay so the gibbets do fit so you can still customize these just like a regular croc um let's try these on the strap is kind of stiff I think if I put these out in my garage like overnight and just air them out, I think the smell, because the smell is kind of hitting me. It's kind of giving me a headache. Okay, very comfortable, true to size. Okay, okay. Let's put this one on. Okay. Stand up here. Try not to break my neck. This is what these look like. So true to size, definitely feels like not as comfortable as Crocs. Like, I feel like, I don't know. I feel like there's just no support in the inside. They feel pretty flat. And I think it's because the texture in the inside sole is just there for design. They're not very like leveled like the original Crocs are. Um, so I think that that could be... The problem is it's not providing any support. It's almost just for design, you know? So it's just more of a flat shoe. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go outside. I'm gonna get a video of these separate, the Crocs separate, and then one on each foot so you can see them really side by side. So let's go outside. <laughs> comparing them I have some thoughts so the wall the Walmart one definitely definitely flatter not as supportive a little bit wonky in the the overall like construction of the clog is not very like accurate one is in good shape and the other one is kind of like deformed um so I feel like if you're gonna spend $14.99 you might as well just spend a little bit more and get the real thing or go try like TJ Maxx and Marshalls to try getting an actual clog, um, try getting an actual classic clog for $16 at like those discounted stores. Because honestly, uh, like, I mean, it's good if you want to like get one to like, to like beat up, to wear in the garden, to get like muddy, one that you don't care about that resembles Crocs, this is good. But like this instead of Crocs, I would have to say that's a no-go because they're not supportive at all. They're very, very flat. It's almost like wearing like sandals almost, which is so weird because there is like some like thickness to it. So I actually want to see because are these as thick? Maybe these are a little bit thicker and 
yeah, maybe these are a tad bit thicker, but yeah, so <laughs> not as supportive as Crocs. So I would have to like pass on these, <laughs> like just get the real thing. Like just, I'm going to have to pass maybe like, I'll of course wear these, but like only like around the house or not even around the house because they're not that comfortable. But like, if I was going to go outside, do yard work, do something, um, I would wear these instead. But these are just a little bit like, they're just not it. They're not it for me. I'm sorry. So I'm going to have to pass on them. And yeah, so it's a no for me, but it's good to like try out and see what's out there. Um, there could be some good dupes. So if you guys have any recommendations, let me know so I can film a video on it. But yeah, so I'm going to have to say it's a no for me. These are just, the holes are too big. It just doesn't look right to me. And that like, this is just a no-go. Like that looks really weird and just not, not it. But $14.99, what do you expect? But honestly, like I expect a little bit more for $14.99 because that is a little expensive for these. Like I would say these would be like $5, you know, like mm, this is still a little bit of expensive for $14.99. So it's going to be a no for me, but I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to leave a comment down below letting me know different dis, um, like croc dupes or different stores that carry croc dupes or any other video you want to see this croc miss. Make sure to go ahead and let me know. Also, don't forget to subscribe. Check the links down below to my Depop and my Instagram, and I will see you guys in tomorrow's video. Bye.